Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, this is Mona. So today's video is going to be a what's in my beach slash pool bag. Um, it's going to be it's spring here and we are going to soon enter summer and Phoenix it already feels like summer. It's scorching hot. So we are spending most of our time in the swimming pool and also currently we are in our beach vacation in uh, Santa Monica. So I thought this is an apt place to shoot this uh, video. So here I have my uh, beach bag. So it's like pretty large uh, tote. This is uh, it's like a straw tote, but it is not actually straw. This is made of a ma paper paper material, and it's like a uh, it's like a woven all over. It's like beautiful, um, like a cream or white uh, black and white uh, contrast uh, uh, bag. And I found this in Target, and I really, really love it. It's big enough to put in all my needs, and I also put in some of my uh, kids' stuff also in it. So this is how the bag looks from the top. As you can see, this is pretty spacious, and I can easily carry it over my shoulder like this. I put some shots of me wearing this bag somewhere through in the video, but this is how it sits on my uh, shoulder. I can show you like this. So, yeah. It's pretty big, but that's that's the size I need uh, to put all the essentials for the beach uh, or uh, pool. So let's see what I carry in the bag. Um, to start with, on the on the handle of the bag, I always uh, have uh, like a catch clip like this. So on the beach or when I'm outside in the pool, if I need to put my hair up, so this comes in handy. The first stuff, the important stuff I need is a towel. This is like a huge, humongous towel. It's like a six feet towel. So uh, if I have to lie down on the beach and if I don't have like a picnic blanket, this is this is good enough. And it's very big enough so that if I get wet, I can easily dry myself up. And I really, really love this uh, towel. The next item is, I don't know how many of you carry this. In most of my bag, when I'm out, I usually carry baby wipes. Baby wipes comes in handy for many things. If you find don't find water, if you have to wipe your hand, wipe your face, or anything, uh, baby wipes comes in handy. So these are the these I bought from I think Costco. These are the Kirkland ones. Uh, baby wipes, uh, baby wipes ultra soft. Yeah, so that is baby wipes. The next item I carry, um, I like to carry this, uh, what do you call this, scarf. So what do I do, I carry like one or two of these. If it gets too windy in the beach and if I don't want to put my hair up, I tie this around my hair like this. So it keeps my, it keeps the hair, the front hair out of my face. So I like to carry one or two of these um, in my um, bag. It also sometimes comes um, like a, like if I want to just lie down on the beach, I can just throw it on my face like that. Yesterday my husband was using it like that. So it comes in handy for a couple of other purposes too. But the primary use of it, I like to tie it over my head. And the most important item when you go out on a beach, sorry, sunglasses. So this pair, I bought it yesterday, or no, no, day before yesterday, when we are in the uh, the beach because I forgot mine in the car, and I thought uh, I don't have anything with the, uh, I think I do have, but I don't know where it is. I don't have anything with a different like a white or a cream color uh, rim. So and these are like pretty big. So I like big sunglasses when I have to stay stay out in the sun. To cover my entire eyes or and even give more coverage so I like big sunglasses and I think these are pretty cool yeah so the next item 
from health perspective the next item which is very important we are out our um, sunscreen for now I use this one for, for my entire family the, these are the banana boat uh, kids one uh, and they are tear free sting free they're water resistant for 80 minutes no fragrance and they are SPF 50 SPF is very important guys please don't ignore it so I I agree sometimes I don't like to put SPF because it becomes like sticky shiny all over but at least for your kids use it and do use for your uh, do use it on YouTube um, to keep yourself uh, away from all the harm uh, UV rays and then the next item I do carry some snacks I get hungry we stay in, when we go out to the swimming pool or to the beach we stay there at least for like an hour or so and for the beach it's more actually so we do need some snacks and I carry a bunch of snacks sometimes I do carry some fruits but this is all I have um, left over in my uh, bag at the moment and then H2O is a very important factor so I always carry a water bottle when in my uh, beach bag so they are very very important and always have them fit and the next item I have is like a travel size a wallet or like a, a wristlet to, to have all my uh, important any if I have to get, go out if I need some ID I put it in there and also to keep my phone secure uh, so this is uh, I carry like a big size uh, wallet or a, a clutch I would say a wristlet uh, and I do carry a small pouch which will have my other essentials so let's see what do I have in here I don't carry too much stuff I there, there are some uh, hair ties I got these in a store yesterday here they were it's called like a mini so and I thought they were really cute it had like all the pastel colors so I thought it's really cute and lip balm very important and I also have a hand sanitizer so you may not know when you will need a hand sanitizer so always I do carry a hand sanitizer and yeah that's it I think I should refill I always like to carry some band-aids with me because when you go out with kids you may not know what you need but I think I have some like band-aids that the cloth one but not the band-aid so I have to refill it and you always need uh, uh, I don't know you can you always use like a plastic bag to put in all your uh, wet stuff but I think uh, these are just like very I think three dollars or four dollars from Walmart I thought they were very pretty it has all the cactus and all those other things to represent uh, Arizona vibes so I thought they were pretty cute and it's like a wet bag so you can put all your wet stuffs in it currently it has my um, uh, swimming uh, wear so yeah that's where all the wet stuff will go last but not the least I do have a swim cover up in here it is like a simple uh, romper like a top but it's like very light you can see it's like a very light uh, linen material and I thought it would be very cool for uh, Arizona weather uh, yeah, and also it can it can like uh, double up as a dress if I have want to. I don't want to spend like like twenty thirty dollars on just like a swim cover up where I, which I cannot wear later for anything else. So this I thought will uh, solve the purpose of a swim cover up and also like a dress. So that's all in my bag. It's all empty now. You can see it's like a very spacious one, and um, yeah, I really love it. I've been using it for this vacation. Like for the last like two three days and I'm really really liking it. It, it gets pretty heavy. I, I think that's that's okay because I'm not going to be carrying it on my shoulder all the time. I have to just carry it, put it on the uh, swimming pool or I have to just carry it and just take it to the beach. So I think that's that's fine. I think I have all the essentials which I may need. If you think there is something else which I may have to carry to the beach and if it's missing in my bag, please do let me know in the comments down below. That would be very helpful for me. I do have two boys, like toddler boys. So if you think there's something else which I can carry, I do also put in their stuff like their um, extra pair of clothing. Just that is all I think extra which much I may need for them and their towels, their uh, beach towels. Other than that, um, I've shown pretty much everything else. So if there's anything else which I can carry to the beach or the swimming pool which would be very helpful, please do let me know down below in the comments. 
if you found this video helpful please do hit the like button and also do subscribe to my channel thank you so much guys thank you for watching see you guys